what is up, um, chicos? You've been collected here. We are live from Miami. And I'll make some Cuban crack. So let me show you. and I did and it's some cards I've never shown it before Salud. it's hot it's hot so I'm taking that before I hit the gym I try to um, switch it up I take it pre-workouts but as well I take it sometimes so coffee it hits you up too let me show you in my pre work that I'm picking out it's called MP Soap so um, every time I finish my pre workout I always um, change the brands um, I never try to do it the same brand after another yeah what else oh so I got a letter that I have not shown from Beckett and I'll show for that last, I'm doing it right now, a care package. Bam. This is for, and let's see if you guys can guess. He shows, and mostly in, um, in football on his channel. But he as well has in baseball. Most of his stuff is graded. And he is a player, a collector. That's going out on it today. So these are from 1971 at tops. I have um the three cards from three different players. I'll show the Bart Star one um last. So um first I'll show you I have a OJ Simpson. Um, he did bad things outside of the field. So yeah guys, from 19, or the 20, you guys um, I might know more about these cards than I do, I wasn't born yet, and it is card at number 7, and then it says the 9 yard game. These cards have a different number, so and this one here is for my PC. I PC and Larry is punk as well with the bun Gracie and Dana Marino. And those are my top three guys for the Dolphins. I see. Which this will probably go for great just to be in the set. that I'm doing so that we got a, a long term project and it's card number 30 with the 3 yard game and then now the Bart Star so the Bart Star's card number 50 
and it says nine yard loss. So is this part of a game or something? So if you guys think you will help me out with that. So uh, he passed away on Sunday, man. I did a video back and this card is not like in good a condition. So the back of a little bit of ghetto in the corners. Um, I did a video like 10 videos back maybe. Uh, and it was a regretted responding video of something you uh, maybe had in your collection that you would regret. And I had two Bart Star. Um, autograph and mini helmets. One that was Alabama and one that was a dual with the Packers. And now when he passed, it really sucks. So that's something I do I regret. Uh, at least I could have kept one, but I was out of high school. Now. I bought them at doing high school. For cheap, I bought them for 50 bucks. They're gone. Um, it's five star. The a hidden treasure is just a box, and then um, you open them. And I bought two of those. I ended up um, selling it. It was my first item I ever sold on eBay back in like 09. So I sold it, and uh, yeah, went for like a 200. Now it's worth 800, and now I probably more. The last time I checked, it was 800, but now after him passing away, but it's got a tradition. Scott, um, he did a video on March Star. I saw it on my PlayStation 4 on the TV. I saw it, so I wasn't able to make any comments at all. At which I'll look back in. And I do that a lot at night. I just I watch on um, the PlayStation. I watch on my YouTube videos. So uh, sometimes if I don't comment, and I am on a watch of your videos. But uh, he um, uh, he was sharing us some cards and they were being sold from Bart Star, which they're fake. And they actually uh, look real, but uh, it's studying a bar stars autograph for a while and there's a lot of them sold for for a top cash over a hundred or more and there's one that was authenticated by a PSA and as Johnny says it's a fake and that one sold it for 300 and and I got this back from the cover the gun voice from Beckett because I sent him I don't know if you ever remember and I had um, I sent him first to a PSA um, I had an autograph from Dana Marino it was a green um, ink autograph and it was PSA it came back uh, negative and I wanted to um, it just got us taking a penny. So the next big company out there, I believe, is um, Beckett. And I will put it on the them. And let me see if you want to post this. It did not pass. Not authentic. It says um, the letters, it slants angle and pitch. Um, this danger, it Relax and the flow it says and yeah. so that's what they said about that so um, I've had this already here for some time already since I extended it and, but I never got to a shirt on that video so be careful and what you buy on eBay if it's not it's now it's even with the whole PSA thing going it's hard to buy something high-end if it's not it's certified by the company as well um, there's fakes like 
Donnie said, and he showed that there are the cards autographed by Bart Starr, and the back even had the sticker that they're authentic, the signature, and it's not. So yeah, guys. So that was my only card I have from Bart Starr. I would like to get um, some more. He is a Ipoca legend and a Packers a legend as well. So the Packers have had a good luck with your quarterbacks. And from Bart to, to Brett Favre, which that's my second favorite quarterback as a kid after Marino and now to Aaron and Rodgers now. So you guys have had a good luck in picking your quarterbacks. Not like the Dolphins. The Dolphins after Marino. Tank, tank, tank. So yeah guys, I'll see you guys at tomorrow. Don't forget to stay humble and stay positive. I'm gonna enjoy my cafe. Cubano.